Regulations are so fly, and they're typically the result of a lot of public discussion because executive and independent agencies have to comply with the Administrative Procedure Act. Under the Act, most agency regulations must undergo notice and comment, a process of soliciting public comments on proposed regulations and issuing public responses. In Air Transport Association of America versus Department of Transportation, a regulation that wasn't cleared for takeoff took its wheels up anyway. Congress passed a temporary statute giving the Federal Aviation Administration greater enforcement powers. The agency then developed regulations laying out penalties for regulatory violations, as well as a dispute resolution framework. Although the agency was required to promulgate these rules according to the Act, the agency believed its rulemaking fell into two exceptions to the Act's notice and comment requirements. First, the agency believed that the rules were procedural. Second, the agency believed it had, quote, good cause, unquote, to find that notice and comment was, quote, impracticable, unnecessary, or contrary to the public interest, unquote. Relying on these exceptions, the agency issued the final rules without notice or comment. However, the agency did seek and respond to public comments after the final rules were issued. The Air Transport Association of America believed that the agency was required to follow the Act's notice and comment procedure and petitioned the United States Court of Appeals for the District of Columbia Circuit to review the matter. The court granted review. 